There are different ways of showing percentage in Tableau and in this tutorial I am going to share a simple trick to show percentage in the form of a wheel where each segment represents 10%. So without any further delays, let's get started. Welcome back, this is Gurpreet from DataWiz Canvas and in today's tutorial, I'm going to share a simple trick to show a different way of representing a percentage in Tableau. So for this, I'll be using sample superstore dataset and in order to do that, let's, let's create a placeholder field in a column shelf by just double clicking into the column shelf and type one in it. And just click on the drop down, and I would like to use a dimension here. Now in this scenario, I would like to show a profit ratio, which is nothing but showing it in the form of percentage. And if I just bring the profit ratio in here, it will give me the profit ratio of 12.47 percentage, right? But I won't need that right now, so I will remove that. And I will right click on profit ratio and create a new calculated field where I will simply say one minus profit ratio. So what this will be giving me is, the remaining percentage. So if profit ratio is 12% in this case, one minus profit ratio will give me remaining 88%. So I will click OK here. And I will change the marks to pie chart first. And here I will simply bring measure name to the color shelf. And I will double click on the measure values. And you will see a lot of values came in here. So all the measures came in here. I don't need all of them, so I will just remove all the other ones. So I just need profit ratio and one minus profit ratio. So once I receive, once I do that, I will simply bring the measure values from here to the angles. And you will see a pie chart is created. So once the pie chart is created, we will simply remove all the formatting first. So I will remove all the formatting from here. I will go to borders and I don't need row dividers and I don't need column dividers. And also we go to the zero lines and we remove all of them from there. And I will remove the headers as well by just right clicking onto the axis and remove headers. What I will do again, I will just simply click on this placeholder field which we created on column shelf and press control in Windows and command in Mac and just drag and create a another field in the column shell. Once you do that, you will see two pie charts are created. I will just create a dual axis for them and you will see the overlap is happening here, right? So just remove, synchronize the axis and remove the headers. And once you do that, you can go to all and increase the size. So this is coming along pretty well and entire view. And now we will go to the second pie chart and I will remove the measure name color thing and it, you will see it's all gray, grayed out and I will change the mark type from pie chart to a shapes and you will see a circular shape is there but I have already created a shapes here so if I go to the finder window and if I go to documents and if I go to my tablet repository shapes and under shapes, I have created custom shapes already. So if you see here, I have a lot of custom shapes here and I have created shapes similar to this one and which have all these wheel bars which are poking out. So it's something like this. And I have created one in black and one in white color. So I will show you how to use it here. So I will simply go to the shapes shelf and go to more shapes and I will select the custom shapes and in here I, have, I will select the shape which is white in color and I will click OK. Once you do that you will see already that shape is on the top here and it will show you all the different segments of a wheel. And right now we are going to show profit ratio so I will move the color legend at the top and you can adjust the color so I don't want to show the orange color I rather want it a uh, light gray color so I can use it this way or if I want to go for the light shade of that I can simply go here and I can try a really light shade and 
press OK. And you will see the shade, the wheel is created now with a different percentage. And in this case, it's showing 12%. So what I will do here, I will go to the shapes chart again, and I will bring the profit ratio and put it on the text label here. And you will see 12.47 percentage is there. And I will do a bit of formatting and bit of alignment and I will bring it in the center and allow the labels to overlap other marks. And then I will increase the size of this to let's say 18. And you will see the percentage is shown here and each segment is showing 10%. And if you want to increase the size, you can go here and adjust the way you want to show it. And here you go. Another simple way to create a pie chart and show the percentage. I hope you guys like this tutorial. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do so, so that you get notification when I put another video. Thank you so much. See you next time. Bye.